I haven't came up with a name for it yet. Anything, but it's this thing I do. And it's like, it's with wants and desires. And basically, like, I'll make a plan, I'll make a desire. And then I'll stray away from that plan, that desire, and um, do something else and find a new plan, find a new desire, and whatever the case may be. I'm not saying that that's a bad idea. I'm not saying that it's bad. It's just today I've seen or realized that I'm still in the same loop. I'm doing the same things. Um, here you go. I bought these blue headphones for twenty dollars. You didn't need to buy. Luckily, I bought those instead of the Beats because I feel like it would have been a worse investment. I have a pair of three hundred and fifty dollar headphones right here. I have headphones. You know what I'm saying? The reason why I had Apple AirPods is because I do. I still believe that I need two different pair. I, I do believe that I need a better pair and whatever. But it's like prioritize. In the sense of prioritizing that other pair, I need. I don't know. It's so weird. It's so weird. It's so weird. I can't even get it out. Because it's like I'm contradicting and fighting with myself while explaining this. And it's because it's all based off your life and your desires and your wants. Like right now, I'm wearing these um, Vans right now. Them Vans was $60. And I ripped the side of these. But I just told myself right now that I'm wearing them shoes. I'm 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 going to go back to wearing them shoes. Today, I wore my Timberlands. Um... And before that, I was wearing my foams a lot. Timberlands was like $70. My phones was like $230. Um, when I first bought my phones, they didn't feel so great. But um, I like them now. I like wearing them. My boots, they're just for show. But I enjoyed wearing them today. Ain't nothing wrong with me wearing my clothes. It's just my life is not where I want to be to really just, you know, want to wear them. It's weird. It's kind of weird. But um, the reason why I'm making this vlog right now is because I wanted to buy a system today. And currently I'm 21 years old. I don't think I've had a system since I was like 18, 18, 19, 20, 21. I haven't had a system for at least four years, if I'm not mistaken. At least four years. Um, So... Some may think that, you know, I'm just not a gamer. I don't care for playing the game. You know, I actually love playing the game. At one point in time, I was addicted to playing the game. I don't think it was a bad thing. It was something I enjoyed, something I liked. It's like the day my girl was talking about she wanted to get a system or whatever. And I don't even got, what, systems run about 400 right now. I don't even got 400 in my account. But I'm like, skip it, I'll buy one prioritizing I didn't care but just a few seconds ago I was thinking about making beats so many things I want to do and it's like um, the way I look at it whether things bring you money or not you know you can, I can't look at every part of life in a financial aspect because then I'll be miserable like if somebody told me and brought me the offer of, you know, being able to make four hundred million within the next ten years, if I live in a cave as an experiment, and in the cave you have nothing but food, what the essentials to survive, and I can't leave that cave until the end of the ten years, I wouldn't do it because it's missing ten years of my life and living in a cave just to get. To Four hundred million dollars isn't worth it. This is mind boggling. It it isn't worth it when you look at it in that aspect because you might only survive five years. So you really just spent all this, you know, time working to get this money and you can't enjoy it. You can't spend it. So it's like it's kinda weird when you're stuck in like you're in a position where I'm in where I'm like a poor citizen can't afford many things 
It's like I want to save work, the little basic nine to five jobs I have, which is going to take way longer to get to that amount. But my goal is not 400 million. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, say if I want this, I want that, I want that. You know, these things cost money. So, you know, I can work, save to get to this money, this amount of cash. But it's like at the end of the day, if I'm not being happy or receiving happiness with that time, it's a possibility I might do it all for nothing because I might not get to that place where I want to be. It's very weird. It's very weird. And I do not know what to do. So it's like, I, I, should, I should buy a game, right? $400. Because it's like, I know the game is going to make me happy, right? Play the game, but then what? It's like, I don't know. I mean, like, I don't even know what to do, bro. I really don't know what to do with life. Because it's like, I'm happy, but I'm not content. I'm not happy with my situation. You know, I'm happy with things in my life, but I feel like, you know, I want this. I want that. I want that. And it's like, love yours, whatever. It's a lot of songs that let you know that, you know, you ain't going to never be happy in life until you love the thing. But it's like, I don't know. I, I'm lost. I'm very lost. And it's funny because I was talking to my man's d the other day about this. It's like, I was telling him I feel like I'm a leaf flying in the wind, just blowing in the wind. And it's like. A car can just be in front and it can stop me from getting to my destination or it can drive this way and blow me in a whole another direction. It's just a lot. But I don't know what I want to do. I mean, like I, I try to tell myself, oh, I can get a game because I can start a, a, a gaming channel and um put that on YouTube and that'll be productive. At the end of the day, it shouldn't have to be productive. You know what I'm saying? If it's making me happy, I should be able to do it. I shouldn't have to find an excuse to do it. But it's like at the same time, I really don't know. I really don't know. My biggest thing is um, I don't even know where I'm like. I don't have a plan on like living wise for the next three months if the makes sense. So it's like I buy a game right now for four hundred. That TV gonna get irritating very quick. I know it is. That boy's small and stupid looking. I like big TVs. I'm not gonna hold you, but um, so weird, so weird. Cause it's like I would think I would be like uh, smart with my money, but I don't know. I feel as as I look around. I'm not the most savvy person with money, you know. I like just spending my money. Wow. It's crazy. I even spend my money on food and don't don't want to sit there and cook it. Hey, just don't buy the food, mate. It's hard. It's very hard. Huh. Huh. I don't know, man. I, today I'm not working. I, I, the job, my job texted me and told me I had to work tomorrow. That's kind of depressing. You know, obviously, you know, I need the money, but it's like, nigga, I don't want to work. So weird. I'm so weird. Wow. Uh, It's gonna be funny to look down the line and be like, "Oh yeah, this is what I did, and this is, this is how I, you know, elevated my life. This is why I'm happy, or this is what I miss about this stupid time that I was in right now." I, I mean, hey, just funny to look, like be able to time track and look back in life. <laughs> Lately, I just been feeling like so lazy. So lazy. And it's like. I tell myself, you know, I'm skinny. You know, I'm not overweight. So, you know, I'm always doing. I'm I'm, I'm working. I'm, you know. Shoot. You know. Yeah. Man, I'm lazy. It don't make no sense. It's like I tell myself, oh, oh my gosh. I'm lazy to the point where I call myself lazy because it's easier to explain 
it's easier to say lazy than explain what I really mean. Like if I had to really explain what I meant by what I'm saying every time I said I'm lazy with the amount of times I say I'm lazy, I would be exhausted. I'm exhausted right now just trying to explain that concept to you guys right now. I'm weird. I'm very weird. Well, I ate Mexican food for this this morning. Leftovers from last night. So I got to cook when my girl gets back. Been very productive lately. Just been doing productive things. I have. I actually have been doing productive things, Nate. Like right now, I'm looking at a somewhat cleaned area. Way better than what it was. You know? Wow, Nate. This is what you're doing with life. This is what you're doing with life. You can be way farther, but it's not. It's not no problems. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. Do I want an Xbox or a PlayStation? Do I want to buy a game. Hmm. I don't need. I don't even have the same desire to have a new camera. That's weird. Hmm. Funny how my light just won't just ch fluctuate, change, and all that. Like my mic stand and it's not even up. Like, literally, like that's my mic right now. It's just standing there. I don't even have a desire to make a song. I low key do, but I think since I told myself that I want to make my own beat, it's like I I gave up hope for myself making a new song because like seeing myself make a beat is just like <sighs> I really think I pay like 120 for this or 100 still haven't used it still haven't used it I played with it haven't used it it's a difference still haven't made a beat with it like I really sat down and made a beat huh that's weird that's weird how many things I could have got? Even if it was only a hundred, I know it was at least a hundred. Do I can get with a hundred dollars? Huh. Look at some of the other stuff I bought. I have stabilizer and I don't have a system. My stabilizer costs like three fifty. System could have got it for three fifty. Hmm. But it's like I'm investing in the things that I wanted to do. It's just. I didn't put the time into doing those things. Or maybe, you know, I strayed away from wanting to do it as much. I don't know. Because I don't use that stabilizer. But when I bought that stabilizer, I was ready to use it. Trust me. It's just things happen. It's weird. It's weird. It's don't, it just doesn't. Things don't play, go out this plan. Play out this plan. Like right now, I, I'm really thinking about having a house. And I want to, like, just deck out a room where it's like I got all my my hobbies and just wants and desires in this room. And it's like, I'm just doing everything I want to do. The only problem I run into is having to work. Having to go to work. Having to leave this sanctuary of awesomeness. Sound very really funny saying this. Awesomeness and just punch a clock. I do not want to punch a clock. I do not want to punch another clock, another. And that's why it's like I'm sitting here thinking like, oh, I want a game. I want to do this. I want to do that. Right. I'm telling myself. I want to do all these things. But not as bad as I want to not have to do this. I do not want to have to punch a clock. I want to be rich. I want to do things because I want to do it. I want to feel like, oh, I'm tired. I can go lay in the bed and be lazy. Because 
I can have 10 off days in a row if I really wanted to. You know what I'm saying? Like, I didn't, I don't have to wake up and work tomorrow. This is not my only off day and I don't have to use it wisely. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. A lot runs through my head. A lot runs through my head. But I, I actually feel like this is a decent video. I wonder what I would name it. I'm so lazy. I don't even be having a real name so I'll be I'll just be like ah, H W T Y Z Yeah Y'all wouldn't get it. Y'all wouldn't get it. Cause I actually do put a little bit more effort to that you know, just give it an actual chunk name, but seriously I don't even be taking the time out to have like no real names. It's almost sixteen minutes in. Hmm. Favorite number. Woohoo. Who no depressing moments? No, brain uplift, uplift, back in action. I see that chin here going in. So many great things going on in life. I'm with my girl. You know, I got a roof over my head right now. You know, I'm driving. I ain't paying the arm and leg for the car insurance. You know, I'm working right now. That's cool. Got good little food. I'm slim. It's a lot of great things going on in life. And I appreciate it. It's just I don't be knowing what I want to do, bro. Huh. 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 It's like I, I'm at the point where it's like I want to tell myself just to work a whole stupid, dumb, large amount of time. It's like after just saying that little stupid just ten years to get four hundred million, but you just gotta sit in a cave, not even a cave, just the middle of like say if this apartment with nothing in it, and they just bring you food every day. You can eat whatever you want to eat. You can have whatever food you want, or maybe not even. Maybe to get the better picture that I'm trying to paint is it's not really a sanctuary. You have the minimum need to survive. Just surviving. You're not reading no books. You're not watching no TV. You're miserable. You're just sitting in a room for 10 years. Just basically in jail. 400 million to be in solitary confinement. And only solitary confinement. For 10 years. And this is an upfront deal. You're going to 100% get your cash. No doubt. No nicks around it. You got your cash. You're good. You do whatever you want with it. You ain't signed to no contract after them 10 years. You do. But you can't spend a dime before. And you got to survive to get it. So it's like you could take that L for your family. But you got to survive them 10 years. And... You know, we can we we're gonna assume that you you're going to survive the ten years. But that's a, I mean like they ain't gonna take you out or anything. They ain't gonna exile like they ain't gonna stop you from getting your like they they legit legitimately want to give you your cash. It's just an experiment or something. Would you do it? I don't think I would. So it's like it's kinda contradictory for me to work. For any twenty dollars an hour, thirty dollars an hour, every day for three hundred and sixty-five days for the next ten years. And not had no sort of happiness because I still won't reach four hundred million. You know what I'm saying? Like even, you know, like uh eh. eh. So weird. That's why I don't know. It's just working. I don't want to work for nobody, bro. I really won't. And maybe this, like, maybe what I'm getting in my head right now is maybe I can just lay my thoughts out. Because even if I never get to do my thoughts and my goals, I got to dream them. You get what I'm saying? Somebody else might be able to live them. Who knows? 
So maybe I need to start thinking out thoughts and just making videos about my thoughts and my plans and my desires. Maybe somebody else can take their money and be like, shit, I don't know what I want to do with this cash. Hmm. And see my idea. See my lifestyle that I painted for myself that I wanted to live. They might be able to go live it. Hey, you got it. You'll live it. Go live it. Hmm. That's a quick little rant, man. I ain't even going to keep adding to it. Get myself up because I know my girl going to walk back through that door soon. And I ain't even do nothing with the past 20 minutes so that I've been in here. I feel a little better getting that off my chest. Clean up good. Did see how 